Welcome back to our channel. Today, we are going to talk about how to plan your day with structure and increase your productivity. We all struggle with getting things done, but with a few simple rules and the help of structured app, you can turn around your life. So let's dive right in. Before we start with the tutorial, let's get into the productivity a little bit. If you want to become productive, there are mainly three things that you need to do. If you follow these three rules, you will surely notice an increase in your productivity. The first step to becoming productive is to capture all of your tasks. Our minds are not the best place to store tasks as they can cause anxiety and overwhelm. That's why it's important to make a habit of capturing all of your tasks. This helps you avoid forgetting anything and reduces the mental burden of holding all the tasks in your head. The second step is to schedule your tasks. Start by completing any tasks that require less than 5 minutes. These small tasks may seem insignificant but if they stay on your to-do list, they can feel like a mountain. Once those are done, Schedule your tasks using a calendar or a day planner app like Structured. Actively plan your day and fit your tasks into it. Remember, what gets scheduled is what gets done. The third is Parkinson's law. This law states that work expands to fill the time we assign to it. If you give yourself 4 hours to complete a task, it will take you 4 hours even if you could have done it in 2. It's important to test yourself and find the right amount of time needed for each task. By assigning less time, you will find yourself more focused and efficient. Of course, there's a limit on how much you can reduce for a task time. What we are recommending is that you keep on testing that limit. Now that we are clear with the productivity mantras, let's see how the structured app can help you apply this in real life. Let's begin by asking ourselves a simple question, why you should use the structured app? Well, there are many apps out there, but structured stands out with its beautiful design and user-friendly interface. It's available on multiple Apple devices, so you can access your tasks wherever you are. Structured allows you to plan your day, add tasks, assign time slots, and track your progress. It even has a notification and repeating task for added convenience. When you launch the Structured app for the first time, this is what you will see. Click on the Get Started button. Now click on Continue. Here, Structured will ask you your wake up and sleep time. This gives a start and end time to your day. If you want, you can add this or skip this. We will add this just to give our day a structure. You will notice the structure has added a couple of tasks. This is to help you get started. You can delete all of them and we recommend doing that as we are going to walk you through the entire process anyway. To delete a task, click on it and then click on the delete button. So let's just quickly get rid of all the tasks. Before we start using this app, let us first customize it. To customize Structured, first go to the Structured menu and click on Preferences. There are a few things that you should pay attention to. The first is Appearance. Here you can choose the base color. We'll leave it at the original color. In Layout, you can choose Full simplified or minimal just play with this layout after you add the task to see which one you like the most here you can choose between system light and dark mode let's keep it at system right now now you can choose between the fonts and increase or decrease the font size let's increase the font size a little bit to make it easier for this tutorial now quit out of it there's also an advanced setting here you can change the start week We'll change it to Monday because we reset our week every Monday. Finally, you can enable calendar and reminders integration to see your calendar events and reminder tasks into structured. Click on it, click on allow access and then enable the toggle for it. You can do the same for reminders. Now we have set up the app. Let's see how you can use the structured app to plan your day. If you remember, the first step is to get your tasks out of your head and inside the app. Structured have a built-in inbox that acts as a dumping ground for all your tasks. To access the inbox, click on the sidebar button in the top left corner. Here, you will see that we have an inbox. You can add a task by clicking on the new inbox task button or the plus button at the top. Let's add some tasks. Now, we have added three tasks in the inbox. When adding tasks, you will notice that when you add a task, for example, let's say we want to add a task of cooking dinner. Structure auto assigns symbols to all your tasks depending upon the heading. But if you want to change the icon, you can do so by clicking on the icon. There are hundreds of symbols available, so you will find one symbol for every task. 
Suppose we have dumped all the task and now we want to put it on our timeline. To do this, just click on the plus button. Here, you can select the time, the date, how long the task is to be done. Let's say this task takes us one hour. You can also assign a task color. Let's say it's our home task, so we will use it green. Now, you can check how often you want to repeat. Since this is a one-off task, we will leave it at once. One of the best thing about structured is you can add multiple alerts. You can get alerts at the start of task, at the end of task, or five minutes before the start. You can add even additional alerts if you want. We want to be alerted five minutes before the start, so we will cancel all the other things. Here, you can add notes and add subtasks. Suppose we want to withdraw cash before buying milk task, we will add it as a subtask. And here, we are adding a note for ourselves. Finally, when you're done, click on the add task button to add the task. As you can see, the task has been added to the timeline. You can use the plus button to directly add the task to the timeline. You will see the similar task addition box. Let's say we want to go for a run in the night. Let's add a couple more tasks to flesh out the timeline. We'll color code tasks for different domains of our lives to make it more stand out. Notice how my day is organized. I can see where I have free time and add more tasks if I want. For example, here we have 4 hours 30 minutes left, so we can assign any task here to plan our day. So there you have it guys. You can see that structure checks all the three strategic points that let us complete the job. You can capture all the tasks in the inbox, put the task on your day's timeline, and see and manage the assigned time for each task. Since using structure, we have become more conscious of the time we spend and more importantly, how we are spending that time. The app has made us more aware of the limited time we get in the day. There's something freeing about seeing your day displayed in a beautiful UI. And that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed the guide on planning your day with structure, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more helpful content. And remember, structured is available for free on the App Store with a pro version for additional features. So go ahead, download it today. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.